All right. Good afternoon, Shai. Hi. <laughs> Good afternoon, Win. It is another session of COVID Conversations over. Yes. Uh, okay. <laughs> Kumusta man diha? Okay, kaayo, merienda time na. So, igawas na ninyo inyong mga pandesal deha. <laughs> <laughs> correct, <laughs> correct, correct. And um, here in Cagayan de Oro, it's raining. It's like re- raining. Grabe good. Kusog ka ayong ulan din he. Wala ba yung ulan di ha? Uh, makulimlim. Kung sa may makulimlim in Visaya. Makulimlim. Makulimlim. Uh, dagom. 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 Oh. Dagom. Uh, pero diri, kusog ka ayong so, good thing before I, ano, oh. Uh, nakulbaan gani ko kaya basin mag brown out pero oh my gani wala so yun and um so again for those who are watching uh yes uh, this is uh this is our afternoon coffee session and later we'll be bringing in uh ang ipailaila ang atong bisita um nga taga Caraga region so this is our uh, afternoon edition and later tonight na naputay lain bisita and akong kauban later will be our uh, uh, host from Davao, si Jerome Sanoy. So, muna ni ato ang mga prelude to our actual hakbang, which, which will happen on June 26, 2029, the first virtual hackathon in Mindanao. And if you want to know more kung unsa na siya, you visit www.hack-bang.com. Ayun. So, shy. Ayan. Sorry, that was me on the background. I apologize. So, ayan. So, yeah. Um, the, so the difference, because just in case na nai uban deha na, unsa ba nahita bong ano ng na ay COVID conversation. So we're doing this in order for you guys to know more about itong hakbang, kasi we have a live event happening on June 26 to 29, where our participants will figure out solutions sa current problem nato sa COVID, kay daghan ba yata yung problema sa COVID, di ba? For example na lang, wala na ni supply din ng alcohol uh, sa sa grocery, for example, pero naadili sa among uh, all home sa butuan. So nga namang na ay mga deck sa atong mga supply, um, sa supply run nato, no? Or even in the healthcare, we're running out of PPEs this, uh, this early or daghan yun, even agriculture, ang sa una, they're serving restaurants, karon wala na restaurants, asa man sila nagapada ng ilang mga, mm-hmm. ano, uh, produce, de ba? So, COVID conversations, our aim is to just bring you more, an, an sa ba, when? Parang just to let you guys know what Hakbang yeah. is all about. It's so, we're also- gonna... Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. It, so we're gonna do this before the event on the 26 to 29. That way, kabalo mo kung unsa na nahitabo or unsa among ginabuhat during the event because we want to bring in our participants also, usahay or our mentors to let you know what's happening behind the scenes. And of course, after even our live event, kasi we want to let you guys see also the progress of the teams or even just continue these conversations about are around COVID because obviously it doesn't look like COVID is going away anytime soon and we need to figure out how to move while COVID is here. Tama ba yun, Wen? Yes, that's true. And ladies and gentlemen, if you're wondering, there are two ways kasi that uh, Hakbang is doing. No? Uh, we have live broadcasts of the different, during the four days, not a live broadcast of the different uh, mga mentors, speakers, na mga resources na atong gina present to the public while privately ang atong mga teams they will be working very hard to create the solutions in the in the four days nga gihatag sa ili, ilaha ani nga event so dili na to kayo sila makita nga ga marathon gid no like um, we cannot see them because of course we will give them the privacy of ato silang uh, hatagan og time nga sila sila lang sa magsabot kung unsa ang ilang gusto ipakita ng mga solutions. So right now, um, ato nang ginabuhat ng uh, COVID conversations para po, uh, ano ni siya, kanang introduction, labi na kay bago kayong concept sa hackathon din sa Mindanao. So right now, murag nakakita na nako siya sa backstage, Shai. So I think uh, ato na siya ipaila-ila. No? So again, ladies and gentlemen, this is our uh, COVID conversations over coffee.
Ayan. So for those who are just uh, tuned in to our live stream, again, this is the COVID Conversations Over Coffee, the afternoon edition. So pang pampainit sa hapon. So um, Shai, can you introduce our, our guest for this afternoon? Yes, correct. Nako, I'm so happy to have our guest on board this afternoon because he has always been very supportive in terms of the agriculture sector, as he should be. Uh, he is the director of the Agricultural Training Institute here in Caraga Region, which this office is under the Office of the Department of Agriculture. So please, let's welcome Sir Sammy Calonzo. Hi, sir. My hapon. Good afternoon, sir. Can you hear us, sir? Sir, may request na ano, ma-tone down na monitor. Kaya medyo madungog na to, sir, ang atong monitor sa Facebook. Naka siya delay, sir. Ayun. Okay, so, ha. Hello, sir. Yes, yeah, sir. You're, you're live, sir. Hello, hello, sir. Can you hear us? Okay, so I guess now we have a, a technical difficulty. Um, for our audience, if you want to ask questions to Sir Sammy, uh, kindly uh, send your questions by typing down below that um, live stream via Facebook so you can also ask questions. So Sir Sammy, can you hear us? Hello. 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 Good afternoon, hi. everyone. Yes, hi, Hello, sir. Shaila. Hello, Hi, Owen. Hi, sir. Sir, can we request, sir, so, na ang Facebook na monitor, sir? At klaro, ang klaro. Yes, sir. Okay, ba, klaro? Yes, sir. Yes. There you go. Anyway, we'll just try. Yes, sir. So, um, my sir, uh, uh, pwede man over. Good afternoon. And to me in your program, uh, honored kayo. Uh, Yon. So we have a viewer, si Joanne, our avid viewer, and she says, oh, yeah, okay. Ang maulang hapon sa lahat. Yes. Sir, sir di ba natin, sir, mahinayan ang volume sa inyong monitor sa Facebook, sa lain nga gadget? No, no, wala. Your mic is good. Okay, sir. Hello, sir. Madungog ba? Hello. Yes, sir. Uh, Shai? <laughs> when I think I I go pala yes. <laughs> Sir Sammy, <laughs> sige, um, Sir Sammy will just request okay, for okay. you to uh, turn off and Okay, okay. Ayan, perfect. Okay, good. So Sir Sam, we're loud and clear? Oh, I'm not freeze. Sir. Oh, I'm freeze. Yeah. <laughs> So, Challenging ka yung connection ka rin. Oops. Okay, sir. <laughs> so, ayan, you guys are seeing um, the the Agricultural Training Institute here in Karag is actually, in fact, in the outskirts of Butuan, where the signal is, as you can see, not uh, very it's challenging. challenging. <laughs> <laughs> it was and so, um, to our Globe Smart PLDT subscribers, if you would like to help out our government agency so that they can be, um, they would be able to do their their work better because they're doing such great jobs. And if we can help them make it easier by providing fantastic internet, that would be great. So while we're figuring out um, if Sir Sammy can connect with us in a while, that would be. Great. Sir yeah. Sammy, are you there? Hello, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Mad yon, mad yon, me. Sir, so how are you? I think the delay is. Uh, On Facebook, my power. Oh, yes. Yes, sir, please. <laughs> okay, na ashay 10 seconds, sir, my delay. Wala na off na. 
Ang uban. Ang uban, ang uban, ang uban. <laughs> tanan, tanan, tingin lang. Uh, uh, ang monitor, sir. Ang monitor lang, sir. Pwede sila mag-tan out sa mo sa Facebook, but they should have to close the the monitor for us to, para dili mag, mag-sapaw-sapaw ang atong sound. Ayan. So yeah, I love sir, how you said yes to us right away for this interview. But yeah. as you guys are we are having technical Hello. difficulties. Sir Sammy? Murag ma... Ika freeze, no? Pero maduog mi, Sir Sam. Short ang... Sige. Um, okay. we'll, 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 we'll try to work on this on the background, but... Yeah. Um, we'll try to get you guys, Sir Sammy, because we really want to have this interview with him. Yes, yeah, sir. Sure. Yeah, we we yeah. really want to have this interview with him. Why? Because we want our government agencies to get on board with us in Hakbang for uh, for them to be able to share. Unsa nga ba ang ginabuhat ng gobyerno para sa ato ang mga kababayan no tungod man good sa usahay uh, and there's not um in news or in media or in it it just gets drowned in negative information sometimes some of course a lot of the times it's the truth and there are times that it's not and so the good news is just being covered by so many of the negative things that is going on so maunang what we wanted with these coffee conversations with our government officials is for the clients to see that our public sector is in fact doing a lot of work and if it's not at par with what we are expecting for them to provide you know i hope this is also a little a time where we can extend a little patience towards our government agencies because um we mustn't forget that the whole world the whole world is grappling with this kita pa na third world country it's right. not an excuse it's not an excuse that we're we're in a third world country this is why we at takbang are also trying to move already tama when we don't want to take yeah. this sitting down we don't want to take hakbang sitting down so that's why we're yes. inviting you guys mm. um ahead. yeah i will attempt again to connect <laughs> with uh, sir uh sammy okay <laughs> hi hello sir so there seems to be a problem hello sir can you hear us murag <laughs> na i delayed no a <laughs> grab so, Muni siya ang challenge siya in the online world yes. now. Hello? Yes. Okay. Hi, sir. Yes. Okay, Owen. Okay, Owen. Yes. Sir, um, how are you there, sir? Kumusta? <laughs> He's so <laughs> Because he's really trying to get on with oh, this video. Oh okay. Sir, um, how do we do this? Uh, um, perhaps we can try it another time. Is that yes. okay? It's Sir, not perfect. We really want you yeah. on board. We really want you in on this conversation. I mean, we actually have viewers who are waiting to, to oh. be with you. Well, so it's such a shame. Um, Sir Sammy, we will get in touch with you again so that we can set another yeah. conversation with you. Yes, we, we would oh, love that. Yes, on um, Saon, you know, because we would really want to have you on board and really explain to the public the, the amazing work that uh, the Department of Agriculture is doing. Kay, um, ang spotlight ba karon is already on, on the that the kana nga klase nga frontliners those who are in the the fields no and the mga farmers mga nasa agriculture sector kay nakita nato nga we have to go back to basics so okay. this is something, uh, so, um, probably shy what you can do is you will call um sir sammy and maybe we can uh, have another time to to do this especially na nagkaduol na sa hakbang but of course we still want um the government sector to be part of this uh, activity so hmm yeah, sure. try? i'm uh, asking them to give sir sammy a call <laughs> yes uh oh yeah. so, and we will continue this conversation with him yeah. at another time 
So, okay, exciting unta na kay because you want to uh, murag ituhog nato banget. Karon we karon hapon, is supposed to will have the uh, public sector and their yeah. action towards uh kaning the pandemic, no? And then later on tonight at 8 o'clock, we will have naman the private sector and that will be their uh, response also. Kung giunsa sa private sector, nag-create sila o mga movement, no? On their own uh, sa pag-respond to, to the agriculture challenges. Ana. So, but of course, atong mga friends who are watching, uh, tomorrow, dapat ay lain nga Nino, we have another uh, guest from the public sector, si yes, Sir Ray Desiata, administrator of Butuan City. I'm so excited. Uh, it's been a while. Dugay na kawala niya kita ni Sir Ray. So at least tomorrow, I'll be able to see him online. So um, si Sir Ray is the administrator of uh, Butuan City. So naapod tayo conversation with him tomorrow. And that's going to be what time, Shai? It's going to be Ang at 6 p.m. Yes. So, yeah. why do you want to talk to the Butuan City Administrator? No, It's because recently we actually saw the count. Like in Metro Manila, there's the count is so high. And in some places in Visayas even, and of course in our Mindanao counterparts, na apod mga cities na taas ang number. Pero here in Butuan, praise God, we only have so far 11, um, 11 positive COVID mm -hmm. cases. And they're all in um, quarantine already. So the government is doing the best they can. And so we wanted to highlight that, especially at this time when we can see on social media that Yes, there are negative things going on, but you know what, guys? Daghan put positive if we can just put a spotlight on them. So please watch out for that. Um, if you have any questions for Mr. Ray Deshata, our city administrator here in Butuan City, um, do stick around tomorrow at 6 p.m. Ayan, when? Yes, so, and in the morning, Shai, we also have another guest tomorrow. Katulo ko magkape ugma. Um, in the morning, I will have, <laughs> I will have at 9 o'clock, Miss, uh, the architect from, the Filipino architect um, of Suito Designs. Um, her name is Glory Rose Matilia, and she will be joining me and um, Jerome tomorrow morning. Uh, we will be talking about safe spaces, how to create safe spaces in this time of pandemic. And I think that's very, I don't know, that's very uh, timely. Kay, if you notice, atong mga, atong mga establishments, mga buildings, mga institutions, they're trying to create safe spaces. Medyo mabakikaw usahin or awkward na tanawan ang mga places just because uh, you want to make sure that the, that the public is safe, the guests are safe, and also those who are working in that space are also safe. And even our homes, we have to make sure that our homes are safe spaces, kay, at least sa balay. Kanina malanggani ang atong pinakahaven or atong sanctuary. It has to also be safe. And you have to make sure that it's secure. So tomorrow morning, that will be with uh, Miss Glory Rose uh, Metilia at 9. So naami, uh, naami chika chika in the morning about that. So interesting kaya itong weekend, atong Friday tomorrow. And yeah. naapagod at 6 with Sir Yata. And tonight, naapagod no, they're from agriculture. So they're the private sector. And they will be, uh, they will be joining us. Uh, they will be joining us tonight at uh, 8 o'clock, Ako and Jerome, so ang Agricultura, ang CEO and CMO of this very young company nga, Young Sadkud, ang atong mga uh, officers. Ayun. So, right. so, sayang kayo, no? I really wanted to, to have uh, ano, Sir Sammy today. I know. I was very excited. In fact, what was even so nice of Sir Sammy of ATI to do was to accommodate us this afternoon. We only messaged him this morning and he said yes immediately. Yeah. So it's a shame, but we do mm -hmm. promise to give you uh, to give him time with us again in the future. In the meantime, our six-day, uh, four-day event is coming up real soon, real fast. So just yes. to give you guys idea of what we're having in that program it's so we wanted to make sure that the programs that we have are available because we're going live from 8 a.m to 8 p.m so imagine while our participants are doing the problem solving or figure out, figuring out solutions at the back and our mentors are guiding them 
in Facebook and YouTube, we wanted to give you guys some form of entertainment that is helpful to you during this time of COVID. When do you want to go ahead and give them some examples? For example, for day one, what do we have lined up for them? Yes, um, actually for day one, China, we will have the opening ceremony. Uh, that will be, we have yoga in the morning. So for those who would like to have yoga, not early morning yoga, and of course this will be with our friends from the mga yoga teachers here in Cagayan de Oro. Uh, then we have, of course, we have uh, some talks. We also have, um, this is interesting, no? the basics of hydroponics. We, we will have that, kung unsao na to ang pag uh, pagtanom without using actually uh, kanang garden soil and then after that around four o'clock we will have the plight of women in the face of the pandemic so we have an international panel of amazing women and they will be they will be with Shaila and Rena of Team Hakbang and they will be discussing about the the the, the experiences of women in the different facets of life. Uh, aning karon nga naa ang pandemic. So it's interesting kayo ni siya kay natay mga international nga mga uh, bisita kauban pud sa mga Mindanao nato nga mga bisita nga mga kababaihan. Then we have artist performances and so the kan kayo gitag ma uh, maabtan ani sa first day pa lang na siya. So while na na siya din sa makita nato sa Hakbang uh, TV and sa official Hakbang page sa Facebook uh, on the background Sugod na ang atong mga teams og formulate sa ilahang mga solutions nga ilang ipakita sa fourth day. So kita nga wala naka-register, for example, nalang ka sa balay, of course, we will also give you entertainment, we'll also give you learnings and insights, we'll also give you things na pwede ninyo magamit or pwede ninyo ma, ma personal knowledge for you. So muna siya ang interesting about ani ato ang hakbang. Okay, shy. So Yes. So we also have other uh, segments that are helpful for you guys. Uh, last week, we got to interview Arlene Hidalgo. She will be teaching us how to transition your business to the online platform. Because like we said in that conversation with her, a lot of businesses are having problems right now transitioning to the online platform, especially our um O -o older constituents, right? They're having a difficult time just grappling. Ano nga ba tong internet? Ano nga ba tong, uh, Facebook? Lazada? What is going on? So um, Arlene is going to teach you guys more about that. So do tune in for that. Gary Hidalgo, her husband, is gonna teach us how to garden. No food na makaon nato. How do you how do you plant onions? How do you plant um pechay? How do you make your garden, no matter how little or how small the space is, how you can actually have your own produce grown right in the heart of your home? Uh, we also have somebody, uh, we have a couple who is going to teach us about food styling and food photography. Because when the gan bayat na makita na mga businesses karon na mga homegrown na mga pagkaw yeah. na lami kaayo pero usahay makita ni mo murag di mang wao kaayo ang picture usahay di ba nang Instagramable as they say sayang yeah. Oh, oh. So, sayang yung potential to sell if dili guapo atong photo. So, please watch out for that because Noel and Ray Salazar will be talking about that in our four-day program. Daghan pa win, no? We have so much oh, in store. So shy, di ba? Every day we have a cooking show. Correct. Every 11.30, oh. we a live cooking segment. And lahi ni siya, guys. Dili ka lang mo tanaw sa ila. We are inviting some of you... Uh, People who are, who want to join us, na magluto gud mo, maguban gud mo ni chef in a online oh. room. Can ask the chef questions, no? Kung sa pagluto, hindi tumud kung single ba si chef, married oh, ba si oh. chef. <laughs> and the good thing about this is we will be posting naman the ingredients way ahead of time, so you will know. Uh, if you have the ingredients already sa imuhang pantry or sa kitchen or kung wala pa, may time to actually buy them, no? Um, Dili po din ka tong grabe ka sophisticated kayo ng mga ingredients, mga mga saffron, daling ana. Mga something lang na naaragin sa ato ang mga sa ato shelves or nasa sari-sari store or nasa atong uh, favorite grocery. So, na to na in advance and then we will enjoy mm. Sige, Wen. Sorry. My apologies. Diba? Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. 
<laughs> okay lang. Go, go Shai! <laughs> Sorry, because there's a delay man <laughs> with sa hi mo nang we overlap sometimes. Uh, oh. Anyway, Chef Victor yes, yes. is actually going to teach us how to um, cook something with adlay. Ambot lang no, diha sa inyo sa CDO. Pero dili sa butawan, there's uh, adlay everywhere. It's cheaper than bogas. It's cheaper than rice. And it's yeah. funny when... Mas barato, kaysa, eh? right? huh? Mas barato ang adlay? And healthy. When? Yeah, I, yes, I know it's, it's healthy. So I didn't know that it's mas barato di ay kaysa bugas. Barato sa ato. Sa Karaga. Yes. Yeah, or in here Bulaga. in Mindanao. In yes, in Mindanao. I, just, I, know, I know of people nga gagbalig yag adlay, but from Bukid nun, I don't know kung pila ilaha per kilo. And I, that's interesting. Karun ako kay Balo, if maudain na, then I might try because I I haven't had rice for quite a while na baya. So, Kung adlay is an alternative because it's a grain, right? It's not really rice. It's a type of and grain. Healthy. Correct. So healthy. even adlay, makatawa when, because uh, some of the people here, the IPs, the indigenous people here in Butuan, when we were with them, and Sir Sami, in fact, in one of our um, oh. one of our lectures, in one of our workshops, makatawa kay mo ingon yun sila na, susbam adlay raman sa amo, adid tuwa man ni Bugaso, usahay, bubaba oh. Buto one, mugas to me 10,000 pesos win para na as oh. for one month. You know what I told you? I could take a mahal sa adlay di, sa Manila. Kamahal ano? Oh. <laughs> diba? It, muna siya kinang, it's a, it's a specialty nga kinahanglan ni mo siya source out. Dito Kaya, is ano lang, kinang ato lang kinang gina ignore. So yeah, that's interesting. Like, so maybe Oh, yeah. siguro uh, magpalit ko adlay para makapil ko ana. And then that's the good thing now we can take pictures of uh kung dili man kakapil sa live stream, maybe you can take photos of your output sa imuhang gibuhat together with chef and then we can uh upload it sa ato ang hakbang page para makita nato dito sa community or sa group nato nga naay mga photos sa mga nag-join sa ilang output, di ba? And we also have one chef, uh, Chef Melissa is also joining us. And it's so interesting. Um, what she's going to teach us is how to recycle the food. Like, for example, um, for example, you're cooking uh, adobo in the in lunchtime. Uh, Tomorrow, may natira kang adobo. You don't want to eat the same adobo you had yesterday. So yes. she will transform it to another meal. And then she'll transform it to another meal. So three meals out of one original one. meal. Wow. Muraganan ko na. Especially that I live alone, Shai. Diba? I mean, sometimes, listen to the guy if I just want to cook one fried chicken, diba? That's so bitin or tulo, tulo lang ka slice. So sometimes I cook for bulk siya. Pero, yeah. uh, of course, dili na pagkakinahan mo kaon because it's the same kind of food na imugi kaon earlier. So that's interesting. So for a person like me na nagpuyo, alone, that's something that I can also benefit benefit from. Yeah. So, karun, may, may gani kina share ni mo siya, that's interesting. No? Yes, um, so so daghan sure. parehas ako ang na-interest, Anna. Okay, karun pa na ako, ano wala ko kikalo ako? <laughs> Sayang topic. Oo, but, uh, oo. Because when we talk for the, about... For the sports power, sunshine. Yes. Ang sa to siya? It's Ansa to, going to uh, be... We talk already. Uh -oh. So please mm. join Chef Melissa on the 27th. In fact, she asked us for an earlier time. She will be on at 11 a.m. to teach us about these three recipes from one, in fact, main recipe. So do watch out for that. Um, don't think that this hakbang is just for the problem solvers, no? It's also for those of you who just entertainment at home. So our hackers are going to, they have to be busy finding solutions of course, we want our audience, you guys, to have something to enjoy watching as well. Problem-solving man ka po That's a little problem na na-solve na to. I mean, more like life hacks, di ba? We always see that on Facebook, mga life hacks. And this is these are life hacks that we're sharing, no? Na, uy, you don't have to spend much. Na, na naman ko na ibra. Sayang naman yung mo siyang ilabay. So, you might as well... Uh, make use of that particular meal again but of course para ano ma excited ka imo siyang i i kanang i make over or something or how do you call that uh, then ganina i mentioned about mga sports lovers okay for those na very active 
na yung mga healthy lifestyle and I'm sure sila ang usasad nga medyo affected no physically and emotionally I'm sure they're affected because wala sila ka experience na mag to balik sa gym labi na katong hilig og routine di ba ang uban part of their daily routine mm-hmm. two to three hours of gym gym time or they have to jog they have to do basketball now um na, na- meet ba nato ang atong gigopuhan ba sa atong oh, team oh, so Jerome married na daw. <laughs> uh, ayun, so um ano, so, so na- yeah, when pa to siya yang schedule? Yes, yeah, so coach Javi is going to join us on the 27th of the web at 4:30 p.m. So watch out for that. He's going to teach us. Uh, it's an online basketball thing. You don't have to have a ring inside your room. It's not that. So it's just yeah. basically like the basic movements, like how to dribble properly, how to um, do do it sideways. no. So very interesting. And we can and have you join. And it's free, right? So that's the good thing about this. It's delivery. Okay, they're actually, they're, they're selling, I mean, they have a registration for this. Yeah. If gusto nila. Oo. Yeah. So at least, and then, Gary, delay ka rin siya eh. Yeah, so yeah, they're charging 2,500 for 10 sessions, but imagine for Hakbang, Coach Javi, coaches are giving it you guys are hakbang viewers for free for an hour on the 27th at 4 30 so do watch out for that yeah yes. i think when and i are both sure we're not overlapping each other again <laughs> Mura grabe ang internet karon mura ganahan siya mag-challenge ato ano uh, gusto siya nga challenge tas at ang communication skills usaw ni karon na yeah. makadili sa tapaw <laughs> so dagantag mga mga performances pud siya so we have actually uh, mga musicians singers and they were they will be performing for us on those dates and also naapata um, we also have financial wellness, no? I especially karon ka realize na ko nga sige na lang taog um online shopping, kung wala mga lingaw, magsige grocery. And then um, also kapagawa sa kwarta. So this is also one way for us to really look at our finances and think of how to manage our finances well, especially now that we are not really sure until when magiging pandemic, until until when man tami ingon it's safe to go out and it's safe to really mingle and you know go on with your businesses. So um, we have to make sure nga although we spend, we have to spend wisely. So um, Natay's guest Anna who will be talking about that. And then of course we have uh Chef Jeffrey, no? Uh, yeah. Of Lime and Dress, maapod siya on June 28. Naapod siya yung mga i-share sa ato. Yes. yes. Mm. And Chef Jeffrey is from Toronto who moved here to Butuan to share his talent with the Butuanan people. He is with Lime and Zest. So, ayan, yung mga ganahan yung kumukaon sa Lime and Zest, si, si Chef Jeff <laughs> ang atong kaubad uh-huh. sa 29. So, do watch out for that yeah. at 11. PM as well. So the no, so many things are happening. That's why we wanted to do COVID conversations over coffee. Kay daghan good topics na kanang lan i cover good natin during not during this time of COVID. So do watch out for that. Yes, and nasa tay mental health uh, awareness. So I'm sure everyone's kind of cranky lately. Kay wala na takabalo na unsa natong life. So um yeah. na automatic negative thoughts namang abut sa to uh, and trying to ano no trying to challenge us uh, mentally nga naunsa naman niya tong situation so there's a coach uh, a brain health coach uh, a wellness coach nga mutabang sa ato to let us understand what is going on right now nganong inguna na atong reaction and what could be a better response to all these challenges that we have in our lives so that's very important no? our mental health dili lang atong physical kay na, na covered naman ni coach Javi ang atong physical uh, well-being ang ato na pong mental health ang ato ang i-focus together with coach RJ Goyaneche 
So naapud ka ana. So this is going to be a well-rounded gud nga mga discussions no from financial health, uh physical health, napugid tay spiritual and kanang uh, sa atong nourishment. That's why we have, we have yoga and other mga kanang pang pang enrich sa atong um, mind and body. Correct. So ayan, so that's yeah. there you go. So I hope na nakasabot mo kung unsa ba yung difference ng the actual hakbang four day live event and these COVID conversations over coffee. That is to say that we will actually be mm -hmm. having COVID conversations even during the four day live event because sometimes we want to get in touch with our teams like oh, kamusta naman sila diha? Kamusta na ilang ideation? Yeah want to get to know what they're doing and of course there's still some people in the government sector that are already tapping us asking us for a time to speak about their projects in this time of covid so that more of our kababayans will know what they're doing and so that other lgus or other local government offices can hopefully be inspired also by these so do watch out for that we will have more covid conversations over coffee um pre during and post the live event 26 to 29. Yes, and we would like to say hi to our viewers. Uh, I have a viewer from the UK, my niece, uh, Justine uh, Webster. Ang iyahang husband, si Lyle, is one of our mentors. Uh, he's, a engineer, he's, a, he's an engineer there in the UK, and he's into design. Oh, wow. na mga, mga kanang Bago ng mga mga machines dito so uh, and he's also an artist so he's he's so good good when I said na na we have this event and then he was there during the media launch so I'm so sure he's also excited too from them and in fact interesting no sa mga ganahan diha na mag team members or basi naguna kuna pa mo guys na anay ni uban sa hakbang from another country I couldn't even pronounce it mm. when, when the registration this morning. I'm like, yes. oh, may international team tayo. So, oh, from Netherlands, yeah. Oh, see, so oh, oh. guys, Mindanaoans to step up so and show you the Philippines and the world that the Mindanaoans don't have to take COVID sitting down, that even if we are in the four corner, within the four corners of our room, it is not going to stop any Mindanaoan from doing something to help in our fight against COVID. Tama, when? Yes, correct. And of course, we'd like to say hi to Mami Neneng Hamison Sana who's watching. Hi, hi. hi. Hello, Mami. Uh -oh. Kimbo. <laughs> we also want we to are. say hi to Joanne. Aya, Joanne, your friend who's always watching us. Thank uh -oh. you for your support. Oh, grab we want to say hi to Sheena Hembrador, who is watching all the way from Dubai. Madoka Thomas, who is watching from Manila. Johnson C. Jao Nuida from Manila also. Emmer Buenaventura. And of course, Daniel Defensor Sanchez, my father-in-law, is also watching from the next room, in fact. <laughs> Ayan. So there you go, guys. Um, we again we wanted to have Yon, grabe. So um, go in. Hey, go, go. <laughs> Gra grabe internet karon. This is something first time nato naging unani. <laughs> it's a challenge. In fact, indeed. Kaya ayan, smart globe PLDT. Please step up your game because in fact. We're surviving companies, and the Filipinos are paying fantastic money for your services. <laughs> Please help us, help us, help the Filipino people. Globe, smart, and PLD. Yeah. <laughs> especially that we're now going online, especially in education. So if, imagine that, no? That will be another challenge. Um, mubaba magani atong attention span nga medyo, uh, Taas -taas na atong edad. Unsa na lang ka ang kids. So I hope that ma okay na niya to internet. <laughs> but for now, I think that's it for our live COVID conversations over COVID. So again, thank you so much for those who are here, who stayed. And uh, of course, we'll get back to Sir Sammy and we'll have another uh, moment with him uh, within the week or next week. Uma siguro or maybe next week. Uh, yeah. Before, of course, kay next week na baya ang ato ang uh, yes. next weekend na. <laughs> so for those who are watching again thank you so much and again please visit our website 
That's www.hack-bang.com. And also, registration is free for all those who would like to participate. You don't have to be uh, an IT developer. You don't have to be like a kind of mga super intelligent formula as long as you have the vision please do uh, join us and we'll help you form your idea and create it into reality yo yo there you go so thank you everybody for watching um this has been owen and shyla and this uh live stream was brought to you by hakbang your step towards the next normal bye guys <laughs>